Okay, now let's start finding restricted values or restrictions. And we're going to come across those whenever we have rational expressions with variables on the denominator. And why is that? Well, remember that anything, any value at all, say 20 over 0, that just doesn't exist. And basically it's uh, in a way not allowed. So every time that we run into the possibility of finding a value of 0 in the denominator, we have a restriction. Let's see, let's work on this rational expression first though. We have 1 minus 3x to the 4 over 24. Because we don't have a variable on the bottom here, there's actually no way to get a 0 in the denominator. Therefore, this rational expression has just no restrictions. No restrictions. <laughs> I can't write that fast. Anyways, but what about over here? 2x minus 4x squared over x. Now, if this x is 0, then we get 0 in the denominator. And that would be a restricted value. We just can't have a 0 in the denominator. Therefore, x equals 0 is a restriction. So x cannot equal 0 for this rational expression. That's it.